you're not supposed to ever be sick. Never. The body is a miraculous machine that has been created to take care of itself and heal itself if we don't interfere. But you make yourself sick. And if the mind is powerful enough to make yourself sick, it's also powerful enough to heal you. First, we've got to find out why. Why did you do this to yourself? What were you trying to tell yourself? Every disease is the body talking to you. Now, cancer, most of the cases we have found is caused by suppressed anger. If the person could just talk about what was bothering them, but they don't, they hold it inside. They always say, I don't have any problems, you're the ones with the problems. Well, that's what I was gonna say to you. I mean, for someone to uh, take, I mean, what you're saying is they've got to take responsibility and say no matter how they feel about taking the responsibility, they, they they've got to say- talk about it. Yeah. And sometimes it goes way back to childhood, but they hold it inside. So after a while, the anger begins to churn around, finally eat away at the organs and creates cancer. But it must be hard for someone to, to, to take responsibility for themselves. It is. You know, to that's say my, that I, that's I, I, they've caused it. As a therapist and a counselor, to get them to talk about it and we figure out where it comes from. But when you become ill, are you saying then that every illness you've had, you've brought on yourself? Yeah, but I don't get sick. What, what because you're more balanced than most no, people? because I know how it works. <laughs> nice. <laughs> Once nice. you figure it out, you don't get sick. Okay. One thing they told us, the side effect of doing what you love, what you're supposed to be doing, the side effect is perfect health. So when you're totally in tune with yourself. In tune with what you're supposed, and to, what be you're supposed doing, to be doing. what you're supposed to be doing. You don't get sick. Not even the common cold or? Well, a common cold would mean you're working too hard. They want you to rest. But you're talking about life-changing illnesses. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah, because uh, it's amazing. They come from all over the world to my office in this little town in Arkansas. But, but you know, someone watching this right now who can't afford that kind of trip. I've trained hundreds and thousands of people all over the world. So there's someone in this, in, in, in near, you know, uh, I have in England. Given, I've trained can... many people in England, yeah. and they're having the same fantastic results that I'm having.